Jeffrey Ibrahim leads the field. Mercedes AMG coming out on top. What a start to the weekend in the Fanatec GT World Challenge Australia. First Red Bull helmet. Hey, I'm out the cage, gotta let out the beast. Revolutionary guy, let out the streets. Locked in a cage, I'ma let out the head out the. How much sleep did you get last night? Oh, about half an hour or something. Rock Feeney starts car triple eight, the man filters AMG. To get an understanding of what sort of vision that you have as a driver at speed. Jeffrey Ibrahim aboard the Triple Eight Man Filter AMG Mercedes. Home race together, two cars. You'll enjoy it. The start will be much more noisier mm -hmm. and chaos. On red, they're on green. Nice, quick, early flick, and into second place goes uh, Prince Abu Bakar. So victory, the first one in 2022. Fanatec GT Racing here goes to Nick Foster, flashing the lights. In that second place in the podium, Abu Ibrahim and Jasmine Jafar. The grid will be bigger, I think 20 cars in Japan, so that would be interesting. In the Fanatec GT World Challenge, powered by Adam Mercedes AMG from Triple Eight to Hall Motor Racing, first and third. Shows how serious this is, though. This is the top GT championship in the region. So there's a bit on the line. Cars just got back. Um, it's such a shame because he was doing so good at the time. Uh, he was he was on it. As I said to him, um, we all crashed in the first year of Bathurst, so um, don't, uh, don't don't let the pride be scarred too much. Stop that.